Evening. Oh yeah. Sorry. So how was your day? Fine, yeah. Oh, anything good in the paper? Oh yeah, I was just reading about the election. The bloody election! Oh, that's all people have been talking about all day. I am sick of it. Well, it's pretty important. Is it? Yes. Really? Yes. I don't know. You can't just win arguments on... What makes you think it's not important? Well, it's just a popularity contest, isn't it? Maybe a little bit, but... You know, it's the popularity of, like, our political parties and their policies, you know? Yeah, but these competitions never work, do they? What do you mean? Well, I mean, look at X Factor, right? It's always the runners-up that do the best out of that, not even the winners. I mean, look at JLS, for God's sake. You, you can't compare the X Factor to the general election. I just did. No, I mean, it doesn't make any sense. They're two com completely different things. No, they're not. They're both a popular vote for somebody that people want to win a contest. There's always a whole media circus around it. You text in your vote. You do not text in your vote for the general election. Well, then how do you vote for it? You go to a polling station. Well, now I am definitely not voting, because if you cannot do it from your own home, what is the point? Jesus Christ. Put some politicians in the jungle, have them meet kangaroo testicles, and maybe, and only maybe then, will you get my interest. You know, this is exactly what's wrong with this country. We've got people in their 20s and 30s who, like, have a real chance to change things and move away from the big two of Labour and Tory to a new era of multi-party competitive politics where having the majority of the vote actually matters instead of just some outdated first-past-the-post nonsense. The same MPs get voted in year after year. They've just skewed the system in their favour. And instead, we're wasting all of our time, energy and brain power watching C-listers try to survive for a few weeks in a fake jungle. Manufactured, mediocre boy bands in clearly rigged singing competitions. Six second videos of people just being arseholes to other people on the streets for a few cheap laughs. Just sleepwalking into something even more terrible than Orwell predicted. And no one seems to give a damn. We need to wake up and realise we actually have a chance to change things and that we have a voice that matters. Huh? Oh, sorry. I was doing one of these BuzzFeed quizzes to see which uh, member of Saved by the Bell you are. I got Zach. Ah!